The dryer broke. The entertainment center fell apart. The family is growing and you need a bigger couch. There are several places to purchase new items, but what can be done with the old ones? Tasha Stevens, equipment operator for the City of Fayetteville's Solid Waste Department, says drivers will collect these items, but it's important to know when, where, and what can be set out for collection. Residents can set out up to five items the night before or by 6 a.m. on their scheduled collection day. Items must be placed at least four feet from curb and at least four feet from all obstruction. The items we collect are stoves, refrigerators, washers, dryers, and we also collect household items such as couches, mattresses, tables. We also collect children's toys. Stevens says safety is a top priority. It's very important that items be placed out at least four feet from all obstruction, like mailboxes, fences, rollout carts, power lines. Due to the fact that our arm lives 10 feet in the air and it can hit a power line and be extremely dangerous. It's also important not to place items under trees. The limbs can puncture the hydraulic line, which will cause a delay in service. If items are placed out with doors, the doors must be secured or removed because it's a safety hazard. Children and animals can climb in and hide. It has happened before and we don't want it to happen again. So, if items are placed out incorrectly, myself or another driver will leave a service tag explaining what the issue is and how to correct the issue. Once the issue is corrected, on your next scheduled collection day, your items will be picked up. Darren Bailey, supervisor of bulky items, says some items will need to be scheduled for collection. We only collect metal items on Wednesdays. The items that are considered metal are refrigerators, stoves, washers, dryers, bicycles, lawnmowers. And if you'd like to have more than five items collected or homeowner generated construction, reach out to our call center to pay and schedule collection. The fees can be found on our website. According to Bailey, crews pick up a variety of items, but they won't collect everything. Our drivers will not collect any type of contractor generated debris. That is the responsibility of the contractor to take to the Ann Street landfill. Our drivers will also not collect items that haven't been emptied, such as refrigerators with food or lawnmowers with gasoline in them. Prohibited items include automobile parts, glass electronics, batteries, medical equipment of any kind, paints. If any of these items are placed at the curb, the driver will leave a tag stating why they weren't collected. Bulky items are collected on B Week. For more information and to find your collection schedule, visit FayettevilleNC.gov slash solid waste or reach out to the call center at 910-433-1329. For the City of Fayetteville, I'm Kayla Alenis.